We are at Tea Kettle Junction right now. We got six more miles until we reach our destination of the racetrack. All right, let's get there, fellas. Wow, yo. I can't believe it. And when it rains, the mud becomes so slippery that they just slide around. Moving rocks, here we are. Maybe this is their version of chess, and it's so complex we can't even understand it. Complicated chess board, I like that. That's a solid rock right there. We have visual confirmation on rocks. Of moving rocks? Moving rocks. This is amazing. Look at the kicking up a whole skid mark. Or... Looks like it came shooting down off the hill. Skid it through the mud. Yeah, right, yeah. Stop right there. Death Valley, California. Home of The Undertaker. And we will be doing some time-lapse photography here. Time-lapse just takes one picture over certain durations of time that are then combined together to create a sort of accelerated video image. So I think the trick will probably be a great one cool. to start from sunrise, like to be on black. Like that be like the dawn of the day. It's enough to get 10 seconds worth. So we're just setting up the wide shot here for the racetrack. And hopefully we'll be able to match that into some close-ups that we're gonna go set up. We have our intervalometer, we have our Canon 5D, our tripod, and for the most part, that's all it takes. It's not super gear heavy. The stick tracks are our exact location in terms of the satellites anywhere within 40 feet as we point it and tell us where we are including all topos. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna mark all of the cameras so we know where the hell they are. It's gonna get dark really soon. So we can walk out here and not struggle to find them. Today our plan is to basically get the sun moving over these mysterious rocks of racetrack playa. All right, let's go to the other one. I'm marking camera one. We're probably paint all the trails too, so there's somebody's a lot of foreground activity. We're trying to get our, uh, our night shot. We're gonna go back and cook some dinner, leave the camera here and see what in the sky. Typical fire, your typical Death Valley fire. What do you think? You like it like that? All right, good place. We're back at the racetrack playa. We're gonna get some star coverage here, total coverage. Just getting all the settings up to see here. I have to switch the battery and then we'll do a quick test. All right, let's see what happens. 25 seconds, wow. That's weird, look at that. Whoa, crazy, huh? This is with the cloudy. If it wasn't cloudy, you'd have like a billion stars. crazy on the racetrack last night. We got a nice Milky Way at the very end, very last moment. Just transferring over here on our power station. So far so good, so hopefully uh, it, it looks as good as we think it does. We'll find out. Wow, I've never seen anything like it. This is amazing. Just reviewing some of the night footage stuff really quickly here, yeah, and it looks uh, strangely like an Aurora. I, this, I've only seen them in Alaska, I've only seen them up north, but John seems to think that they can happen here. It's not a cloud though either, because it's just, it's, Where, it's, the it's, it's like down? pulsing like, a, like an way? aurora. It was right, right there. So that's where the moon was going down, right? No, moon was over there. The moon was yeah, way moon over there. there. So, I don't know, we're, so we're still just at the very beginning of inspecting the footage, and hopefully well, there'll be some more on them. It's gonna look awesome, whatever it is. That was awesome. Yeah. Definitely claimed it. Gavin, did you think we got the shots? I think so. 